Hello everyone, my name is Zhe Yunlu. I'm a third year PhD student in biostatistics in Department of Public Health and Population Science at Keck School of Medicine of USC. I'm an international student from China. My research is about statistical genetics, and I'm very happy to share it with you. Genome-wide association study, or GWAS, is an approach that investigates the link between genetic variants and complex disease. For example, schizophrenia or prostate cancer. It relies on ultra-large sample sizes, often on the order of hundreds of thousands, to identify risk region responsible for complex disease. However, GWAS leave unclear what the genes and molecular mechanisms are responsible for disease risk, and the majority of associations are non-coding and likely regulate the amount of gene MRA produced. Transcritum-wide association study, or TWAS, is to leverage large cohort GWAS results and MRA summary data to test the associations between predicted MRA levels with disease risk, so we are able to find genes that are potentially causal for disease risk. While a large conceptual leap towards finding risk genes, TWAS still does not provide causal mechanisms. Similar to GWAS, if we zoom a given risk region, we would find that there are many associated genes, leaving unclear which one is in fact driving the complex disease risk. To address this problem, together with my colleagues, we developed a novel computational method called multi-ancestry fine mapping of causal gene sets, or MA-FOCUS. MA-FOCUS integrates G1 summary results together with the population reference genotype data from 1000 Genome Project and the gene expression prediction weights to better disentangle correlated gene disease associations and output a minimal set of genes likely underlying disease risk. By performing extensive simulations, we show that MA focus can exploit the inherent genetic heterogeneity in the data from multiple population to dramatically improve the precision for finding causal genes while retaining robustness to realistic model violation. Using real GWAS data on 15 blood trees measured in more than 400,000 individuals of European and African ancestry, we performed multiple TWAS and followed up with fine mapping using MA focus. Our key findings are, first, we observe shared genetic architectures of blood trees across individuals of European and African ancestries. Second, we find TWAS-level gene-treated effect sizes correlate better across populations compared with GWAS-level SNP-treated effect sizes. Third, most GWAS risk regions can be explained by one to two genes on average. Lastly, using four independent validation approaches, we find MA focus outputs genes that are more enriched with knowing blood and immune-related function compared to other current methods. The insights generated from MA focus have the potential to inform drug discovery and therapeutics, improve patient screening and treatment for complex disease, and reduce health disparities across populations. I would like to thank everyone who has worked on this project. This is the reference, and thank you for watching.